it's a challenge, but it's a challenge worth taking. A schedule and the juggling that comes along with it that is being embraced by Army sophomore forward Jessica Wagner, who not only helps hold down the low post for the Black Knights on the hardwood, but also is an accomplished thrower on the Army track and field team. Seeing action in all 26 games, Wagner has grown into being a solid contributor for Army, averaging nearly five points and 15 minutes per game. Come the spring, Wagner competes in both the shot put and discus, throwing the discus a program season best 44 meters last year. A native of Minden, Nevada, playing multiple sports is something Wagner has been used to. When I was younger, it was basketball, volleyball, softball. Um, I swam, I did Taekwondo when I lived in Colorado. I did soccer, I was a goalkeeper. Um, I was a catcher in softball. I played pretty much every sport when I was younger. Um, I had to give up you know, half the sports I played when I got into middle school and then had to cut it down even more when I got to high school and I could only play three. And Wagner's ability to compete at a high level in both basketball and track and field for the Black Knights is all the more impressive since it was another sport that first piqued her interest in West Point. It's funny because uh, volleyball was how I initially got recruited for uh, coming to West Point and because of my shoulder injury I said, you know, no, you know. So I finally really started looking into it. I talked to my club basketball coaches and heard about how Maggie Dixon had passed away and they were looking for a post player. So um, I got my connections with Jason Glover at NBA down in Reno. He called up here and with Ethan and they got a hold of coach and he contacted me and started recruiting me. So that's how I got recruited for basketball and then track kind of just came along with it. Army basketball coach Dave McGarity feels Wagner has the ability to stick with both sports. She's got the ability. She certainly has the talent. It's just uh, it's really going to be a decision she's going to have to make and be able to juggle, you know, the two sports. And as long as Wagner continues to contribute in both sports, there may come a day where she has to make a tough decision. I love basketball and I love track, but they're completely different sports and I know in the future, near future, I don't know what's going to be. I'm going to have to choose one. And talking to track, talking to you know future athletes, um, you really do have to choose one because with track, it's an all-year-round technical work. And with basketball, I'd have to you know spend more time watching film, technique, and spending more time on the court with the girls. And I just I can't choose one right now. It's not like I want to, but if I really want to look future, I know that in the next year, I'm going to have to choose one and stick with it. Um, I don't want to have any regrets, so I know the girls love me on you know, both teams, so whatever I choose, it, I'll be happy. At an institution filled with unique stories, Jessica Wagner's ability to play a big part on two varsity teams is something which has made a difference for the Army track and field and women's basketball programs. For ITT Excellus Night Vision, I'm Rich DeMarco.